In this video, I'm going to be demonstrating 10 plugins that are available at great discounts in this Black Friday sales, two of which are free. Links for all of these plugins are going to be in the description below, so check those out. I'm Ed from edthorn.com. Let's get into these plugins. First up, we have Sound ID Reference, which is the rebranded version of Sonarworks. If you don't know what Sonarworks is, it is the room headphone and speaker calibration software that recalibrates the EQ frequency response of your headphones or your speakers in your listening environment. You get a microphone and you have to measure your speakers and it produces the calibration curve of your speakers, which as you can see on screen is this purple line here. And it then imposes the opposite frequency curve to correct correct your frequency inaccuracies in your speakers in your listening environment so you get a flat and neutral frequency response so your mixers translate better onto other systems. It really does work, it's a genius piece of software and I can't recommend it enough, seriously. Now, as you can see on screen, you can see the before and after curves. They're doing the opposite, which is going to give me a flat response to listen to. Now, Sound ID takes this concept one step further and enables you to customize the EQ curve that it's imposing. So if you're happy with how your speakers sound below 100 hertz, you can move this slider so the software is only going to affect the signal above 100 hertz. Conversely, you can move this slider and that will do everything below whatever you set it at, say 2000 hertz in this example. You can also physically move the EQ as if you were using a parametric. So if you're not happy with this bump in the middle, for example, you can just simply pull that down and you can see that it is affecting the curve and minimizing its effect in that area. You also have translation checks. Sound ID have measured all sorts of consumer devices and studio listening devices, such as the Yamaha NS10s, mix cubes, car stereos, in-ear monitors, laptop speakers, smartphones, devices consumers are going to be listening to your music on. And it's created a profile that is then merged with your headphone or speaker profile to give you an idea of how your mixers will sound on all of these devices. It's genius. Check Check it out, it's available for 40% off from the 25th to the 30th of November. Go to the Sound ID Reference website as well and get yourself a free 21 day trial. Honestly, I can't recommend this software enough. I've got a full review of Sound ID Reference above, also linked in the description. Child is a new Fairchild Very Mu compressor emulation from Tone Empire. If you haven't heard of Tone Empire plugins, quite simply, they are the best sounding plugins I've heard. And yes, I've tried acoustic audio, but I can't stand those because you need a degree in software engineering to install the damn things. The installation process with Tone Empire is also the easiest on the market. The very Mu style of compressors, Mu meaning gain, is a gain varying compressor. The input voltage alters the bias of the tubes, which results in a slower, harmonically rich style of compression, similar to that of an opto compressor such as an LA-2A. Now just running this mix through this plugin, you can really hear the warmth the analog circuitry is providing. Have a listen to this. So you get an idea of how rich and warm this plugin sounds, and there wasn't even any compression really been applied there. The meters weren't moving. This plugin is available for $49, which is 50% off, and you can get up to 70% off other Tone Empire plugins over on their website. Links in the description below. See my review of their Loch Ness 2 plugin up here right now. Claro by Sonox is by far one of my favorite plugins. It has so many features, I can't possibly squeeze them all into this video. The plugin is split up into three sections. Here we have a spectral analyzer, which is displaying the resonances in our audio. We also have a width tab, which is again using a spectral analyzer to display the stereo width of our track at those frequencies. As you can see, it's pretty mono down in the low end and pretty mono in the top end on this mix. Tweak mode provides us with all the professional EQ tools we could possibly want, mid, side, mono, stereo, and so on, as well as highlighting the resonant frequencies that we are cutting, displaying the original form. It also displays the frequency ranges in relation to the specific notes that are resonating, also with some descriptive words to help us analyze and discuss our mixes. Mix view is where this plugin really comes into its own because it highlights frequency masking between 
different channels. So for example, I have a keys part and a guitar part here. And these yellow bands are where those two instruments are clashing frequency wise. So what I can do is press invert mode and I can dip the frequencies on one channel and it will automatically boost them in the other or vice versa. This is an incredibly powerful EQ tool and I've been using it on every mix since. This is currently available for 25% off. Link in the description below. Check out my full walkthrough and review here. At virtually half price, the Sonable Smart EQ3 is going to be available on sale on Cyber Monday for 69 euros. Sonable also have two lesser known plugins, also AI driven, the Smart Compressor and the Smart Reverb. They're going to be available from now until the 30th of November at 59 euros. Now the Smart Reverb caught my attention. It uses AI technology and claims to produce the best reverb for your audio. I too was skeptical, but it really does work. Have a listen to this vocal part. Will you take me by surprise? Will you take my breath away? Will you take me by the hand and lead me out into the night? And what I'm gonna do is use the plugin to analyze the audio. Will you take me by surprise? Will you take my breath away? Will you take me by the hand and lead me out into the night in this world? In this world? Now, straight off the bat, I'd say that's a very acceptable and usable reverb. The plugin also supplies you with various parameters you can change as well. You can make it sound more intimate, natural, rich, or artificial. And of course, you have manual controls to set the parameters yourself. Now, you can also control a wet, dry signal. Maybe that was a little bit wet, so let's play with that. Will you take me by surprise? Will you take my breath away? Will you take me by the hand and lead me out into the night in this world? In this world? Tape from Baby Audio is a tape style saturation plugin available for $39 down from $69 until the 5th of December. It emulates the subtle nuances with old tape machines, particularly when they would heat up and impose some pitch variation onto the recording. Have a listen to this guitar part. And then we're gonna impose tape machine and just listen to the detuning fluctuations that we can get out of it. That's one example, but this really comes into its own to drive signals into distortion, which I'm gonna do on a parallel vocal. One thing I like to do in my mixes to vocals in the chorus is run a heavily processed parallel bus sound. And we're gonna use tape to really add some grit and dirty sound to this vocal. And we're gonna blend it in just underneath. Have a listen to this. Will you take me by surprise? Will you take my breath away? Will you take me by the hand and lead me out into the night? Yes, now that sounds horrible, but underneath the main signal and blend it in, it could sound quite nice. Let's have a listen. Will you take me by surprise? Will you take my breath away? Will you take me by the hand and lead me out into the night in this world? In this world? All right, if you've made it this far into the video, thank you for sticking with me. Hopefully you've found some good value in the video so far. If you have done, please hit the like button. It helps YouTube recognize that you're enjoying this video and we'll push it on to more people. Also, leave some comments in below with your thoughts on the plugins and what deals you're thinking of picking up this Black Friday. This next plugin comes from a company that only recently came on my radar in terms of their plugins called Mastering the Mix, who you may have heard of because they have a very popular online tutorial website. Rezo is their new plugin, which is a resonant detection and dynamic suppression EQ plugin, and it does some quite magical and wonderful things. It's available for 15% off, with up to 50% off their other plugins available on their website. Now, one of their plugins is gonna feature heavily in my best plugins of 2021 video, which I'll hopefully have out by the end of the year because it absolutely blew my mind. Subscribe to make sure you don't miss out on that video. So Rezo detects resonant frequencies and what we have to do is play some audio and press calculate targets.
And just like that, in what, two or three seconds, it has detected nine suppression points. Now, what we can do is we can isolate each one of these suppression points and listen to them in solo. And it's not very loud, but I can boost this by dragging this slider down. And that sounds pretty nasty. If you're listening on your phone or, or laptop speakers, you might not hear this, but you will definitely hear that on headphones or speakers. So let's have a listen to the mix without this on. Now I've, I've exaggerated that, so that is exaggerating the cut, so we can take that back just a little bit closer to somewhere where it was before. But now I've heard that resonant frequency, I can't unhear it, and there are eight others that I've got to deal with. Now this button here enables us to toggle between all nine resonant frequencies and listen to them all in solo. Oof. But let's listen to all the resonant frequencies soloed by pressing this button here. Now that resonant content doesn't sound like much on its own, but it can cause a mix to sound harsh and alter the balance of a mix between the lows and highs. Let's exaggerate a couple of these a little bit and then have a listen to the before and after. So it's subtle, but I now can't unhear that. So I need to go through all of my instrument buses and apply this plugin and uh, find out where the resonant frequencies are. Both Sooth 2 and Spiff plugins from Oak Sound are available on sale with a third off both of them. Spiff is going for $99 over the Black Friday period. Spiff is a transistor cutter and booster, which doesn't affect the result of the entire signal, the, the transients that you want to either curtail or boost. And this is particularly obvious on snare drum. So what we've got here is the cut feature. So this is going to remove all the hit and the attack from the snare drum, which we don't want to do, but I'm just going to demonstrate it anyway. And cutting. So you're just left with all the weak sound of the snare drum um, and you're taking away the bite, the aggression and the attack on that. Now, if we go to boost mode, what this plugin is going to do is accentuate the transients without affecting the rest of the signal. So it's a transient shaper, but it's slightly different to a transient shaper that acts as a gate or a compressor where it squashes and affects the rest of the signal. This is just elevating those areas that are attacking and creating that transient that we're looking for. So it's thickening those sounds that we want that are giving the snare drum the body and that presence. And we can also listen to the delta, which is the difference between what we're hearing and what the plugin is doing. So this could be used as a de on vocals, this could be used to soften the attack of a guitar pluck um, without affecting the rest of the signal, or boost it if you wanted a bit more attack. I think there's quite a few uses for this. Quite a subtle plugin, but very musical. Universal Audio are offering free plugins with their sales bundles in their 12 days of Christmas sales featuring a different special offer each day with up to 60% off, including 20% off the new Luna Integrated API Vision Console emulation, which transforms Luna into API's flagship console. Unison preamp emulation plugins from Neve and SSL are also available, as well as guitar amplifier sims from Engel and Galleon and Kruger, all heavily discounted. Third party plugins, including from SSL, Sonox, Manly, Chandler, AMS, API, are all available in this sale as well. And finally, the Neve summing is available at half price for Luna, and here's a demo of how this sounds on a full mix.
Finally, we get to the first of our free plugins this Black Friday season, and this one comes from Baby Audio. It's called Magic Dice, and it is a multi effect randomizer plugin. I think it's quite good for giving you fresh ideas for how you could approach the effects on your instruments. But in this example, I'm going to use it on vocals. Let's listen to those on their own. I saw an angel by my side with tears from heaven. And she cried, I saw reflect. All right, and we're going to just turn magic dice on. And all we have to do is press this uh, randomizer and it will come up with random different effects for us. I saw, I saw an, angel an angel by my, by side, my side with tears, with tears from, from heaven. heaven. Nice delay. And she and cried, I saw a reflection in, in those eyes. eyes. Like a ghost in the night while we were dancing. Spacey. With tears from heaven, as she cried, I saw reflection in those eyes, like a ghost in the night while we were dancing. So you get the idea. There's modulators, phasers, delays, and reverbs available in a random concoction of effects, free to download on their website. Don't forget, as I said earlier, lots of discounts to be had at Baby Audio as well. And the final plugin, which will come as no surprise, is from none other than Waves Audio, who give away a free plugin every Black Friday. Now I can't tell you what it is just yet, but make sure to subscribe and hit the bell notification because there will be a video coming out on Friday with a full demonstration of what that plugin is. I do have it and I actually really quite like it. So stay tuned for that. There will be there is a link in the description below for that plugin. Sign up now and you will have that email to you on Black Friday. Thanks for watching guys. I've been a it's been emotional. Good luck in the sales and shopping, and I'll bid you farewell. See you soon.